Okay, folks. Uh, so something happened. I heard this peeping outside. And, uh, it wasn't stopping. So I found this baby gosling wandering around, and I thought it was too early for any of these nests to be hatching. However, Oh, you're worried, yeah. It's all right, folks. It's all right. It's all right. As soon as they calm down, I can tell you my story. And my story is that there was this gosling wandering around, and I didn't know. Like, these guys are early from, from my count. I don't think they should be hatching yet. So I was, I thought there was a secret nest. And um, the baby was wandering around, like, kind of alone, but escorted by the flock. And... No one really seemed to be really completely mothering it or fathering it. So I was a little bit worried and wandered around and made sure it had some water. And then um, it was kind of being watched over by one of the Chinese geese, the white Chinese geese. And then I did all my chores and came in for the day. And when I came in for the day, I saw... Uh, some more hatchlings here. So I brought that baby in and dropped him off with his siblings. So I have goslings early for surprise. There are four in there so far, but it's really hard to tell because when they're still wet, they stay right under and they might not be done hatching, but at least four. If they were straight pilgrim, as opposed to mixed breed, I would say they were probably, um, the darker ones would be female and the lighter ones would be male. But uh, because they're mixed, it's not really possible to tell. Hey, miss. Yeah, you're settling down. Are you settling down? Oh, poor daddy. Papa Goose. He's had babies hatch of his in this spot for uh, is this the third year in a row. But none of these is Mama Goose. Hey, it's all right. Yeah, you should be used to me right now. Yeah. So one of the big problems when you have goslings is that, um, or any baby animals, is that if they fall into a water dish, uh, often they can't get out and they'll drown. So you need to put stones in all the water dishes so that if they get in there, then they can get out. And you need to make sure that they have water. Um, usually they need a really shallow water dish and it's very easy for them to be, uh, those the shallow water dishes to be dried out or drunk by grown-ups. So um, we'll be arranging for their needs. I might lock them up in here for a little while in the space beside the door. And then at least the other geese can't get in and uh, steal their food and water. My pond's just finished drying out, like, two days ago. 
So it's just mud, not uh, water in the ponds anymore, which means that uh, I can't rely on the ponds out there for them to have their water. Yeah, everyone's settled down. So I'm not looming over them and running in and out. I'm just making actually pretty good goose noises. They like it if you just kind of keep making noises. Yeah. You calming down a little bit, guys? Those are some very cute babies you have. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. It's all right. Oh, mister. You're so worried. It's gonna be fine. I'm gonna stand up now and no one's gonna like it. Okay? Standing up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no one likes it. Just gonna go in a little closer for your baby. We're all right. Yeah, they know that I'm trying to get at the babies. Look at that. Look at how they're protecting everyone. Okay, I'll leave you be. Here, I'm gonna put the door back so you can be safe. Find the door. So there. Right in this space behind the door. And like this is my back door with the dog door, so they come and go. Um, or I come and go right beside them. So they're very habituated to humans. And then if you come look over here. You'll notice that this uh, somewhat mismatched trio is still sitting here. My goodness, she has like so many feathers stuck to her face. Miss, you need to get up and uh, wash your face, really. Your nostrils are full of gunk. That can't be good. Pilgrims seem to have very good nesting instincts, if you notice. A bunch of them are sitting, although out there the saddlebacks are all trying to sit on nests almost everywhere. Well, there you go, folks. Uh, unexpectedly earlier baby geese. Hey, mister. You protecting? You're doing a good job. Oh. oh, there we go. <laughs> you all have a good evening.